Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Today I will be doing an unboxing of a few products that I got from Ohuhu. In all I got 4 sketchbooks and then I got the marker set which has 168 colors. Here we have the mixed media sketchbook which is 10.8 by 8.3 inches. This is another mixed media sketchbook. This is actually my favorite one but it's the 8.3 inches by 8.3 inches. Here we have the marker sketchbook. This is the 10 by 7.4 inches. Here I also got the marker sketchbook 6.9 by 6.5 inches. I didn't expect it to be this thin. For some reason I assumed that it would have the same pages as the others. The texture is really nice and gives it a really cool look. I've had different sketchbooks but they have like a flat surface and they don't look as appealing as this one. So it seems that each sketchbook has a protective sheet inside. I think I will definitely use this even when trying for example new paints or new markers or any new materials that I don't know how they work. I feel like the sketchbook quality is really good and even the price that they come at I feel like it's pretty reasonable. For some reason the markers are not sorted out. I personally would like to sort them out, especially since it's 168 colors, it would be hard to find a specific one. So here you can see that they have a chisel side and a brush side at the end of each tip. Inside the bag of the markers you have these color code sheets where you can fill in the colors accordingly and I will fill in these so that it would be like an easy reference to how the colors actually look because it could be that the actual color does not represent the color on the tip of the marker. So here is one of the markers. It looks really cool as in I like the aesthetic of it. They have the color code on top and at the bottom so no matter how you put it inside the bag you can still see it and spot it out and take it. So I'm going to start with the yellows. I think there are about 16 of these and I'm going to start filling in the sheet. I'm going to do this after each color set so that it will be easier for me to sort them out. I like the intensity of the color. It seems very bright and rich but what I've noticed is that after a few seconds it kind of like spreads a little and fades away so it doesn't remain as bright as when you put it down. It does not bother me but I would wonder whether this is going to spread on the paper as well which might be an issue okay so it seems like there are a lot of reds i think probably this is the most color that they included in this pack and just a bit disappointed to see there are so little blues especially compared to the red also have different sets 320 set which is almost double what i got and they have some smaller sets i believe of like 120 and 240 i'm not exactly sure but then they have more specific sets like pastel colors and skin tone colors i really like pastels they just give me this friendly vibe i don't know if you can relate and they also like this skin tone color set but maybe I should check and see what colors I receive now because I did read that you might get a lot of doubles when you buy different sets. So now that I am done with sorting out the markers, I also want to make a section for pastel and skin tone colors just because I will be using these a lot so I kind of want to have them in one place. I did compare the 48 pastel set with the 168 set that I bought 
and as you can see on their website all the pastel colors are included on the other hand however when i compared the 36 set of skin colors i only had 12 of them so if you really work a lot with human characters then i feel like it's worth getting the skin tone color set Thank you guys for watching this video and stay tuned because I will be getting out a video where I will be reviewing the markers and I will also test the mixed media pads by using different media. If you want to be notified when the next video comes out, subscribe.